Right then, welcome back. And today, well, we're going to do a track guide. We're going to do a Magello short, or the Magello short course. Um, easy to be quick, very difficult to be very, very fast. So we won't muck about over the line. Um, stay to the left hand side of the track. And your braking marker is about the 100 meter board on a faster bike it'll be further back on a slow bike further forward obviously follow the racing line all the way around run wide you want a very late apex just as the curb finishes almost as you're coming out of the corner stay to the left hand side and again your braking point is just as the curb starts you can aim for the red patch the green patch whatever you want tuck it in nice and tight take a bit of curb and the end of that curb is your tipping point for the next corner so you want to throw the weight across to the right don't flip it over the back like i almost did nice and tight on the right run out to the wide on the left breaking point for the next chicane white line on the right hand side of the track again break in and turn in point run it in hot you need a very very good front end for this circuit nice and tight to both curves run it and nice and wide on the exit and this is the difficult one breaking point look for the orange marker on the end of the wall that's where you want to break and turn in don't use the access road that's way too late carry loads of speed run it wide but not over the white line next breaking point for the downhill the right hander is the end of the little crossover on the tracks between the short and the long course and again aim for the end of the corner where the red white and green markings are and the cone you want to nip that corner off as tight as you can stand it up get on the gas and just wish the ZX7RR was a little bit faster. And there you go, 53.954. That is not bad on a 750cc sports bike. Uh, well, endurance bike anyway. And if you piece it all together, it looks a little something like this. the front end look at the difference in the color of the tires all right you need a very 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 good front end and if you do it properly there you go uh half a second half a second at the top of the leaderboard on mediums medium front medium rear tried running a soft rear and it just didn't seem to want to hold on um so yeah i ended up plonking for mediums the setup is on the endurance race at the magello short course on the zx 7r it was a one hour race um and just a heads up the ai are fast they did a 54.8 uh, which would have put them fourth on the leaderboard so yeah there you go thanks for watching comment like and subscribing if you have enjoyed it and you're not subscribed and you want to then don't hang about smash that subscribe button i'll be doing loads of track guides loads of races loads of everything else and hopefully i'll see you next time take care stay safe peace